As soon as the Operator Control Unit, or OCU, starts, real-time updates are issued to its GUI. Notice the current message says to press RB, the right bumper, for controller usage. Pressing RB again shows more help pages. The power button is used to connect to the Sovay system. Pressing back and then power disconnects the system. The start button is used to issue takeoff commands to the UAV. And the back button is used to issue land commands. Pressing and holding LB, the left bumper, allows the OCU operator to speak to people nearby the UGV by enabling the UGV speakers. Once this button is released, the UGV speakers are turned off. The left joystick is used to steer the actively controlled vehicle, and the right joystick is used to control the UAV's altitude and yaw. Finally, the A button is used to accept OCU prompts and dialogues. Pressing A now closes this help dialog. All OCU functions can be accessed by overlaid buttons on the GUI. The UGV is the primary vehicle under OCU control, so upon connecting to the Sovay system, the operator has immediate control over the UGV, with the ability to drive forward, backward, and turn left and right. To communicate with people in the vicinity of the UGV, users must press and hold LB. Note that it takes a few seconds for audio communications from the OCU to UGV to start up. As soon as the user releases the left bumper, the UGV speakers will turn off. Pressing the start button issues a takeoff command to the UAV. Once the UAV stabilizes after takeoff, the user can switch to manual flying by pressing the Y button. At this point, users can now fly the UAV forward and backward, as well as right and left. The UAV's battery level is reported on the right edge of the OCU GUI. When the UGV's upward-facing camera cannot see the UAV during autonomous flying, a yellow warning indicator appears on the left side of the UAV's video feed. This warning disappears once the UGV's upward-facing camera detects the UAV. Pressing the back button lands the UAV. Switching control back to the UGV allows the user to resume driving the UGV. Pressing back and then power disconnects from the survey system.